You can stay here, or one foot goes up the wall. Just one foot at a time. As you press through the foot, push into that leg. One foot at a time. As you push the foot down, it'll lift the other leg up off the floor. And then you put that foot up on the wall. Make sure your hands are still rooted down. Instead of just sinking on the arms like this, to clear the wrists, push from your heart center down through your hands, lift your hips up, and then work to press your chest through. So you wanna move your chest towards the wall, opening the heart. And then come all the way down. So <clears throat> when you come down, give yourself a couple of breaths to recalibrate. And you can, don't have to do all of these in one session either. You can just build up gradually to see which position actually you can hold your alignment in. Again, only go as far as you can keep good alignment and then come out. Same position, come on up. Now when you're up, if you want to start working some more, you can take one leg up off the wall. Now try not to let the leg come flying over because you're going to misalign yourself. So the legs straight up, spread your toes, claw your fingers, connect to that intention to create a humble power in your heart. And then keeping your legs strong, start to push through your hands, lift up. This is how you clear the wrist and then you can do the other side. And switch, take the other leg up and connect back to your intention to create power and deep opening. And with that intention, draw power up your arms into your heart. From the connection of your heart, start to stretch out, push down through your hands, lift through your feet and press your chest through towards the wall. So your armpits still lift towards your fingertips and your heart presses towards the 